What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jimmy, Tro Jimmy, Jimmy111, and I'm back with another video. If you're new, if you're new, you know what to do. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. If you're not new, you know the vibes, man. You already know you're part of the family. To join the family, click that red subscribe button, turn on post notifications, and we lit. That's love, man. But anyways, let's jump straight into the video. Y'all saw the title. No, this video is not clickbait. This is a serious video. I don't know how short it's going to be. I don't know how long it's going to be, but I have to address some things. I have to tell you guys some things. So let's go. Number one. Yes, I'm done with TikTok. Am I done posting on TikTok? No, but I am here to tell you that I am done posting those woke exposing tic TikToks. I'm done posting those woke, you know, exposing things on TikTok. Now, you may ask, Jimmy, why? Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Shit like that. Let me be straight up with y'all. TikTok, I, I don't like TikTok. I hate TikTok. I've hated it for a while. And I'm, I'm tired of it, bro. You know, just being on TikTok, bro. Y'all can agree with me. TikTok is a toxic ass app. TikTok, TikTok is a toxic ass app, like, Yes, that is the app that really, like, that's the platform that, you know, really blew me up, that skyrocketed my career, you know, in making videos, music, shit like that. But it is a toxic-ass environment. It is a toxic-ass environment. It is full of people who, I don't even know how to say Y'all know what I mean. Y'all know what I mean. Like, it's a toxic environment. So I've really, you know, haven't been posting there as much. But another reason, a, a big reason why I don't post, you know, the old videos I would post is because of the censorship. Y'all know about the censorship. I have been censored on multiple occasions. I've been censored so many times, bro. So many times, like literally about two months ago. Y'all know two, three months ago, my entire account got took down. My entire account, Jimmy, got removed from TikTok. They took my entire account down. And I was fighting for, you know, like a week to two weeks to try to get my account back. My account was getting put back up, took back down, put back up, took back down. And it was so stressful. They, t they take my account down, my account where I shed, where I shed light on, on hidden things that things that the government, the people in control want to hide. You feel me? I spread truth. I spread love, knowledge, shit like that. Right. But my account gets taken down. But you dead ass got damn near naked girls on there dancing, shaking their ass, little kids, minors doing inappropriate dances. You got pedophiles. You got pe pedo pedophiles who are who have been exposed, but still got platforms. But my account gets took down. So this happened a few months ago. My account just kept getting put back up, took down, put back up, took down shit like that. And that was really stressful. So when my account got put back up for good, I was trying to, you know, expose some more shit, you know, like shed light on some more shit. But guess what? They shadow banned the fuck out of my account. They sh my account was shadow banned like a bitch. If you go on my TikTok right now, you go through my views. Look at my views. Look at my views. Look at my views. Scroll through. You're going to see like that ass. I got 1.5 million followers, right? But my videos will only get 10,000 views, 20,000 views. Something is not adding up. They would not put my videos on the For You page. Something is not adding up. You feel me? So I just, I kept trying and my videos, they just kept getting took down. They would not spread my videos, shit like that. So it's like, bro, what am I doing this shit for? If like, it's not, it's not doing nothing. You feel me? Like y'all, y'all got to understand. And another thing. That I actually, another reason why I stopped posting the exposing videos, I already gave y'all two reasons. A third reason, and I've, I've said this before, I've said this before. Exposing shit is not, is not helping anybody. Like, yes, it's some cool information. Like, yeah, I made them videos every now and then, but are those videos really helping people? You know, and personally, I was tired of making those videos, like, of exposing shit. Like, you know what I like? I like making those type of videos those videos based off of spirituality, like actually helping people, helping people's mental health, shit like that. Like, oh, you know, 
him over there, you know, he sold his soul. Like, yes, those videos are cool and shit, but like, I'm that shit is not helping nobody. That shit is not, yes, that shit gets views, but is that shit helping anybody? Which is exactly why, another reason why I stopped making them type of videos. Like, how is, what is that shit doing for us? What is that shit doing for me? What is that shit doing for you? You feel me? So, recently, I've just been posting straight music shit. Like, if you go on my TikTok account, it's straight music shit. You feel me? Because I'm trying to take music more serious. And, bro, y'all niggas, y'all niggas are crazy as fuck. Y'all niggas funny. People saying, oh, Jimmy, Jimmy stopped, um making exposed videos he sold his soul he's an agent i'm not an agent and y'all who repeatedly comment that shit over and over and over like y'all niggas been doing that shit for weeks why do y'all still follow me like niggas are like people be weird bro like you think i'm an agent you think i sold my soul you think i'm not who i say i am so why do you follow me why do you still comment on all of my videos like what what no, that, that, like, that shit is weird. Like, come on, like, do yourself a favor. If you truly believe I'm a fucking agent, I sold my soul, do yourself a favor. Do both of us a favor. Unfollow me, unsubscribe, do all of that, all right? So don't waste your time on me, none of that shit. Focus on yourself, because that's what I be preaching to y'all every time. Focus on yourself. But anyways, let me get back on track. So yes, I'm done making those exposed videos on TikTok. The only thing you're probably finna see on TikTok, I'm gonna be coming out there, you know, still speaking my truth, speaking about spirituality, spirituality, speaking about bettering yourself, you know, shit like that. And you're gonna see a lot more music, but that woke exposing shit, that shit ain't going nowhere. So I'm done making those type of videos. You feel me? I might come on here on YouTube, you know, give you, you know, come on here, make a few videos like that. But I really do wanna also step up the content on this YouTube channel and make some like I'm trying to take YouTube serious. Like I told y'all, we, we finna hit 100K before the end of the year. And I want to be way more, way more active on here. So I need y'all to drop some ideas. Y'all gonna see a lot more content on here uh, and different content, like some different shit. Y'all gonna see. Y'all gonna see I got some plans already. We gonna be lit. But make sure y'all have the post notifications turned on so you get the notifications of whenever I post a video. But... Let me wrap this shit up, man. It was a quick little video, quick little update on, you know, what's really been going on. But I love y'all so, so, so much. I mean that shit, bro. I hope y'all been taking care of yourselves. We lit, man. Focus on yourself. Work on yourself. That's what I've been preaching to y'all over the past few months. That's the only thing you should be worried about. You. Fuck all the other bullshit. You don't need to worry about all the other bullshit. It's just you. It's just you right now. You feel me? We're going through a shift and you need to work on yourself right now you feel me but i love y'all so much man and we out of here baby